Hip-hop is 1987.com. Time is Hip Hop since 1987. We're live South by Southwest Austin, Texas, and it's going down now. We just got a chance to check out a dope performance at the Pimp C and Proof Tribute Show. So you may be very familiar with the gentleman that I'm standing with right now. He goes by the name of Ob Trice. How you feeling today? I'm good, man. I'm good. I'm having a good time, man. I'm. I'm it's it's a, it's a pleasure to be down here. They called me at the last minute. I said I'm all for it. You know what I'm saying? To come down here and represent, you know, two legends in the game. You know, so it's a, it's a good look for me. Now talk to me a little bit about about what you been doing. Briefly, for those who may not know, you know, you were running with Shady Records with Eminem and the gang, one of the dopest lyricists that I've heard in a long, long time. You know, you were doing your thing with Eminem and them, 2000s and whatnot, too, early 2000s, mid-2000s. So what are you doing exactly right now? Right now, I got an independent label. You know, I, um, the thing with the thing with Interscope went left, so, you know, I'm not over there with Shady no more, you know what I'm saying? And there was nothing that Eminem could do. He couldn't say the situation. People think, because he the biggest artist in the world that he could have, but Jimmy Iovine is a motherfucker. So it didn't work out over there, but I got my own thing, which is Team Black Market. You know what I'm saying? My whole crew, my whole thing. We putting out independent music. I dropped, this will be my third independent album that's coming out uh, this summer, called The Fifth. I dropped The uh, Hangover, it came out in 2015, and Bottoms Up before that, my independent shit. So, you know, be looking for that. You know, I'm on t uh, Team Black Market at Gmail for booking. If you, anybody want to book, do music, do songs, uh, real Obi Trice at Instagram and all that, you know. Now, as we mentioned, we're down here at South by Southwest. Can you briefly talk to me about the importance of South by Southwest for indie artists and artists like yourself, mainstream artists? To be honest, this is my first time ever at South by Southwest, and I'm looking at it like, wow, you know, this is a very important situation. I met, I met a lot of people that, um, you know, that, that's important people in the music industry. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, it's a good look, especially if you indie and you're coming up and you and you're trying to do your thing. You know, this is a good place to come and mingle. You know, with real motherfuckers, not 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 nobody that's on that bullshit. You know, we out here trying to put music out to the world on a whole nother level. You know. You know, so, so if you serious about your music and serious about, you know, making music, this is the place to be. Yeah, before we wrap up, talk to me about the Detroit music scene, how things are going in Detroit and what you feel like the Detroit music scene is doing right now. I mean we got we got we got a lot of a lot of artists on, on right now. You know, of course we got Big Sean, we got Dage Loaf, we got uh we got Royce the Five Nine and, and, and his thing and um, uh, you know M of course. We got uh, T Grizzly, you know what I'm saying? And uh, myself, D12 still do their thing, you know. You got you got a bunch of artists, my man Snipe, you know, everybody from the D, you know, it's, it's, it's a good music scene, you know. It, 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 we're blessed to be able, because we don't have industry there, because it's Detroit, but we're blessed to have like uh, great artists that's on in the music in the music business today, so it's a good look. What else can we expect from you as uh, 2017 moves along? My new album, coming uh it's called the fifth coming this summer look for that um a lot of detroit cats my man g5 my man um Larik, uh you know uh uh my man uh shit i got magneto seven uh a bunch of cats on the record it's a great record introduces some of the new style of music some of the the new kids shit, the new wave they call it mumble rap but you know it is what it is it's killing the game you know what i'm saying so you know um all type of shit on there you know i take it from that to to, to straight hip-hop underground so it's a, it's a bunch of different things on that record that that people can fuck with look for it it's called the fifth real ob trice on instagram and yeah. Twitter and all that. You had it with us, Terrell Thomas, Hip House 1987 with the one and only, only OB Trice. Stay tuned to Hip House 1987. If you're not a South by Southwest, you're missing out. Get down here. My oh, man. Thank you. Hip Hop since 1987.com.